Hello everybody, my name is Abdul Malik, you're watching Abdul Malik Tech, let's get right into it. You already saw the title, you saw the thumbnail, you know what this video is about, so why waste any of your time? So, uh, this will work whether you're using the Rodecaster Pro, in my, like in my case, or whether you're using the Rodecaster Pro 2. It will also work whether you're using the Atom Mini Pro or the Atom Mini Pro ISO. This method should work just fine. However, there are two things that you're going to need to make sure that everything works well for you. And one of those things that you are going to need is this cable right here. This cable, I'll put the link to this exact cable in the description of this video. And don't worry whether you buy the... Uh, uh, the six feet or you buy any other size it should work just fine another thing that you are going to need is this atom software uh, controller uh, software you are going to need this but don't worry again i'll put the link to that in the description of this video and i'll show you how to download it later on in this video so first things first what we need to do is uh, look on the back of your roadcaster when uh, you should be able to see this right here this uh, the left and right what you need to do is uh, the red tip or the, the side the one that has the red tip like let me show you here uh, what we're going to do is do you see this red tip and this white tip those are key because what you want to do is put the red tip the side the one that has the red tip in the on the right side the bottom red bottom okay red right okay red right <laughs> that's how you can remember and then the uh, white tip this white tip the one that has the white tip you're going to put it on the left side on the top okay and then so this is what i'm going to do it right now so this is the red the one that has the red tip what i will do is put it in the bottom and another thing that you want to make sure is that you push it all the way in okay don't just put it halfway and think that it's fine because if you can see that piece that means that you don't have it plugged in do not worry you're not going to damage your uh, roadcaster by doing this okay but don't kind of come after me if you do but it's very unlikely so push it all the way in and this is the uh, quarter inch side and then the 3.5 millimeter side we are going to put it into our roadcaster pro let me show you on this one because it's going to look exactly the same. As you can see, there's mic one and mic two. It doesn't matter which mic uh, you put in, but just remember if you uh, put it in mic one or mic two. Okay, it's key that you remember that. So in my case, I'm going to plug it into mic one. I'll plug it into mic one. Okay, got it. So it's on mic one. Once you plug into mic one, we are going to jump into uh, the software, okay? So let's open the software. Oh, let me show you how you can download the software. I'll put the link uh, to this website in the description of this video. So what you need to do is go to the Blackmagic website or click on the link in the description and then it will bring you to here. If it brings you to the home, uh, just click on support and then choose the Atom production switcher and then download the Atom switchers right now as of the recording of this video the latest version is the 9.6 okay choose the mic uh, mac or windows whichever one you're on once you complete downloading it what you want to do is on the bottom left click on this gear you might be on general by default but you are going to go into the audio and then by default you might have either the microphone plus plug-in power or microphone choose line okay choose line this will solve any problem that you might have if you don't choose this okay and then click OK done once you do that what uh, you want to make sure you also do is uh, go to this uh, the roadcast I mean the Atom Mini Pro and then make sure that you turn off mic 2 if you not if you did not plug it into mic 2 turn mic 2 off and turn on mic one if you plugged into mic one the same goes for if you plugged it into mic two and also turn off the uh, the audio inputs from the cameras whatever cameras that you have turn that off to make sure that you don't run into any issues since you're going to be recording onto your Atom Mini Pro you want to make sure that uh, you turn off any of the other uh, audio inputs from the cameras from the microphone that you did not plug it in and that should take care of any issues that you have okay 
if you guys have any issues or if you run into any problems or any questions, please comment below and let me know and I will be more than happy to help you guys. With that being said, it's been me, Abdi Malik, and I hope you found this video helpful. Please, please comment saying that this video helped you if it did. If it did not help you, then let me know what, uh, how it did not help you so that way I can improve, okay? With that being said, I'll see you all in the next video. Peace out.